Alright, I'm going to show you how to reboot a Linux machine using Windows. Alright, first of all, make sure you have PuTTY on Windows. Open it up. You also make sure, make sure that you have a SSH server installed on your Linux machine so you can actually SSH into it. You need to type in the IP address, but first we got to figure out what the IP address is. So, we type in if config and it gets us the IP address. But since we have more than one interface, we want the first one. No, this one nine two right here. Type that in here. Then you log in. with the correct keyboard. And if you forget your password, you know, it's going to come up and say, uh, have an error. So, just say heck with it and do it again. Make sure you type in your login as. And then your password. If I can remember what it is. Yes. Then what you get in. Type in reboot. And if you must be a supervisor, you type in SU, then your password, then type in reboot. If you want to make do this, it reboots. Makes me excited. And obviously this isn't responding because it shut it off. So we just click out of this because we don't need it anymore. Huh. We have an error. That means I need a new battery in my computer because it doesn't keep the time and date. But I don't care. But anyway, you get the point. You can reboot a computer remotely. And hopefully, you know, if it rebooted and I didn't have to do that, and you have a new battery, you don't have to worry about that.